Welcome to Fantastic Plastic, a series of SolidWorks video tutorials presented by the Demonic Group. In Fantastic Plastic, I'll be presenting strategies and techniques for injection molded plastic part design using SolidWorks CAD software. I'm Andrew Lowe. I'm a senior industrial designer with the Demonic Group. The Demonic Group is a full-service product development consultancy located just outside Chicago, Illinois. In this installment of Fantastic Plastic, we'll take another look at an advanced drafting technique for applying draft to edges that need to look visually straight. So here we need to add a draft along this uh, kind of lip and groove detail that will interlock with another part, but we need to maintain a visually straight edge as indicated by the dotted red line. So actually looking at this part here, we'll see, you know, that if I had applied draft kind of from this edge with a neutral plane, it would uh, kind of kick all of this back. So we need to apply draft along this entire series of edges. And we'll, in order to have that correct uh, half degree for proper uh, molding. So instead of just kind of doing the neutral plane, which would kind of push that whole edge back, what we can actually do is draft the whole series of edges and the one thing to be aware of is you need to pick every single edge in the chain otherwise the feature will not build so i do need to um, also pick the other face here see how it's going the wrong direction so this is a bit of a manual kind of technique you do need to go in and make sure that all of your picks are correct so that looks good on this series on this series of edges i need to pick this including the fillet and here I need to reverse the face again, so I'll just pick the other face. If I hadn't have picked the fillet, if I'd only picked these two edges, the feature probably wouldn't build. I need to pick every uh, edge in the chain. So I can also just keep going down here and uh, adding the draft as required. So actually looking at the draft that was applied, so here we can draft every single little bit edge in that chain. We just need to make sure we pick all of them. And then what this will do is give us a nice half degree of draft on our edge. So if we evaluate this guy, the draft analysis tool to verify uh, right plane, we'll select half a degree. And we see everything's nice and green, so we were able to add that draft. Uh, if I hadn't have picked all those little edges here, uh, the feature wouldn't build. So it's just something to be aware of. If you do need to create kind of visual edges, and uh, draft from that edge. You do need to pick everything in the chain, but here we have a nice, perfectly straight edge. Uh, nothing kind of got shifted or kicked out when we actually added the draft to this part. So to recap, when the design intent of the part requires a visually straight edge, uh, we can achieve that with the parting line draft tool by picking every single edge in the, in the series. Uh, if the feature won't build for some reason, double check that all of the faces are going the right direction. The, just with the yellow arrows, you may need to uh, pick the other face option and also verify that you picked every single edge in the chain. You know, if you'd missed this fillet, even a little tiny one, the, the feature is not going to build. You do need to pick every single edge in the chain. I hope you enjoyed this week's SOLIDWORKS video tutorial presented by the Demonic Group. Please subscribe to the Demonic Group on YouTube by clicking our logo on the bottom right of the screen to stay up to date on new video releases. As well, click the SOLIDWORKS icon to be taken to our website where you can download the example SOLIDWORKS files used in this week's video. And finally, check out other great content by the Demonic Group, Will It Fill It and Surfaces and Splines by clicking the video links on the left of the screen.